What is the B-21? The B-21 Raider is a new high-tech stealth bomber being developed to replace the Air Force's aging bomber fleet. Designed to be long-range, highly survivable and capable of carrying a mix of conventional and nuclear ordnance. The B-21 will join the nuclear triad as a visible and flexible nuclear deterrent, supporting national security objectives and assuring our nation's allies and partners. Why is the B-21 named Raider? At the 2016 Air Force Association's Air Space and Cyber Conference, then-Secretary of the Air Force Deborah Lee James announced the B-21 would be named Raider alongside Lt. Col. Dick Cole, the last surviving airman from the famous Doolittle Raid. According to the Air Force, the Doolittle Raiders are known for their surprise attack against Japan during World War II on April 18, 1942, which forced the Japanese to recall combat forces for home defense. And U.S. allies abroad. James and Air Force Chief of Staff General David Goldfein selected the name from more than 2,000 naming submissions. What role will the aircraft play? As adversaries continue to invest in and develop advanced weapons, the B-21 Raider will provide the United States with a strategic asset capable of penetrating enemy air defenses and reaching targets anywhere in the world something approximately 90% of the nation's current bomber fleet is incapable of doing. Why does America need a new stealth bomber? Currently only 10% of our nation's bomber force is capable of penetrating advanced adversary air defenses. As our adversaries have continued investing heavily in sophisticated technologies and weapons platforms that leave them free to act maliciously or extend their reach, a new bomber is critical to deterring potential adversaries, reassuring allies, and keeping our nation safe. In a War College podcast, combat strategist and retired Air Force Lieutenant General David Deptula said, the B-21 will provide the kind of payload, range and penetrability that our current force of B-1s, B-52s and, to a small degree, B-2s, cannot accomplish. How many B-21s will be made? The U.S. Air Force has stated plans to acquire at least 100 aircraft. Some defense analysts believe that the Air Force should plan to purchase at least 200 B-21s. Which bases will host the B-21 and when? The U.S. Air Force identified Ellsworth Air Force Base, AFB, South Dakota, Dias AFB, Texas, and Whiteman AFB. Missouri's potential hosts for the B-21 Raider. Ellsworth AFB has been selected as the preferred basing location for the 1st B-21 main operating base and formal training unit, and Dias AFB as the alternate. <laughs>